Okay, welcome back YouTube. Uh, Mr. Steel T. Me here. Um, this is going to be like the video review of my uh, uh, combat set here. This is the Cry Precision uh, AC combat set. Um, yep, right here as you can see. Uh, this is the shirt. Um, very nice, very nice shirt. Um, I've had no problems with it at all. Um, you can wash it in the uh, in the washing machine, um, but don't use laundry or uh, not laundry detergent, um, fabric softener with it because that will ruin the uh, um, the oh shoot what's it called um, the flame resistant part to this to the fabric here, so that if you get caught on fire in a car, you won't burn to death. Um, so don't use fabric software. Um, but yeah, so as you probably already know, um, this is like a regular um, BDU top sort of material. It's a it's nylon ripstop. I don't, I don't know if you, you can really see the little little lines through there, um, but it's ripstop. Right here is where a, an elbow pad would be if I had one, but I don't think I'll ever get any because they're uh, kind of useless and there's the cry precision logo right there and then right here I have a uh, if I tell you I have to kill you patch and then just a multicam flag patch um, and then here all this kind of tan color it's a lot lighter in the in the frame than it is than it actually is this is like a t-shirt material um, it wicks away the sweat pretty pretty well. I mean, I've gone in regular BDU tops and t-shirts and uh, and flannel shirts, and this this is probably right up there with the t-shirt. It 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 doesn't provide a whole bunch of protection to your to your torso. So I mean, if you want one of these or any, or any combat shirt, um, I would definitely recommend having a plate carrier with it because. It won't. It won't feel too good if you get shot in the chest. Um, so yeah. And then up here, this is the collar. Uh, it has a YKK zipper, so very nice zipper. Um, the collar is the uh, same color as the sleeves here. And there, you kind of you can see the more of the material there. Um, very comfortable to wear. Very light. It's a lot lighter than a uh, than a regular BDU top, and when I live, um, you kind of need that. So, um, flip it over here. Pardon the camera camera ship. Um, I'm doing this with an iPhone, so this is what it looks like from the back. Sleeves. As you can tell, I've the pants under it. All comes up through here. The pockets are pretty nice. I have an IFF uh, flag patch here. Um, as you can see, where the elbow pads would go, both sides, and the uh, I'll do this side. It has a uh, a, a Velcro uh, cuff. So if you want to tighten that down, um, you can. As you can see, you tighten it down. You can cinch it down pretty far. So, yeah, two pockets on the sleeves, and that's it for the shirt. We'll get that out of the way, and here we have the pants. Um, and this is probably my favorite part out of the set. Um, there, I mean, I think it'd be a lot better if I had the pads here, um, but they're, they're kind of spendy, for pads at least. So we're going to start here at the top. I'm in a computer chair right now. I'm just moving around. Um, so at the top, there's no buttons. It's just Velcro here and here, which I actually kind of like more than buttons because you can cinch it down to where you need it um, instead of uh, a button where it's just set in one spot. And of course, there's the fly with the uh, another YKK zipper. So good quality zipper won't break on you. Um, and then here's the belt loop through here, all the way to the back, around the edge. And then 
actually on the on this edge here, this is all padded right here. On the back here. I don't know if you can tell. This is all it's 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 not I guess it's not really padded, it's just a lot more material so that um when you're when you have like a second line or something like that, you don't really feel any of it on you. So it's not it doesn't hurt anything. And I I really, really like that. I think that was a great feature to have in this thing. And uh yeah. So moving down right here we have a small pocket. Um it's about that deep, so in the middle of my hand, right there. Uh, you could probably put your phone and stuff in here. I don't know why you'd want to though, because uh, you get shot right there. Um, but I like. I also like this feature too, because if you're in a vehicle, um, it's a lot easier to access these pockets here than it would be in these pockets up here, up here, like that. So I think that's a that's a cool feature that they added to this. Just another one of those features. And then of course the biggest feature. Um, which I don't really get to utilize, but it's still there. Um, is the uh, the built-in knee pads? Um, so I once again, don't have the knee pads. I need to get them. Um, but other than that, I mean, there's a lot of flexibility through here. Um, with normal BDU pants, I feel like there's not a whole ton of flexibility, and that's achieved through this uh, through this material here. Um, it's almost, it's hard to describe what it is. Um, it's almost like a, like a neoprene almost. I mean, that's, that's how it feels. And it's, it's a little, I can't, I can't really show you this, like the stretchiness of it. But you can, it, it's stretchy um, to an extent. Um, not like an elastic, but it'll move around a little bit so you can, uh, so there's some play to it, which is nice. Because uh, if you have those knee pads on, um, you know, they won't move around too much. And then on the back here, you can cinch it down when you're wearing the knee pads. Cinch the pants down so that they're flush to your knees. Um, which is another great feature. And then towards the bottom here, we have another pocket here, which is, I think, actually the same exact size as the ones up there. Um, and I don't really know what you'd want to put down there, but... You can put something down there. Um, and towards the bottom here, yet another great feature is uh, just like the shirt, you can uh, cinch these down uh, to fit your ankle. So if you're wearing boots or something like that, um, you can cinch them down to your boots. And uh, yeah, so on to the back here. So here's the back. Um, uh, like I said earlier, it has this padding on here, nice padding, and it has the same material right here as on the knees, and then it has another small pocket here with a small little piece of uh, Velcro right here, um, real small, almost like the like the size of a uh, ones on the back of uh, like trousers, um, and then right here is the big pockets you'll find on most BDUs. Um, you can put all sorts of stuff in here. Um, I mean, extra magazines, water, anything. You can put anything in there. I mean, sort of a gun. I mean, I, you could probably put a sidearm in here. Small, small handgun. So, um, giant pockets. Um, yep. And then here, you can see the cinch right here. Right here, and then down to there at the ankles again. So, yeah, I mean, if I were to rate these pants out of a ten, the pants and the shirt, I guess. I mean, it's like a it's like a twelve out of ten. It's well worth the money if you're willing to spend that much. Um, but it's a it's it's great, and these will last a long time too. So you'll never have to buy another pair. Until of course they go out of fashion, and then, then, you know you're screwed. But uh, so thanks for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed, and uh, yeah, go check out my channel. Enjoy yourself. Goodbye.